if you like. These two players as well, like me and Simmons have a, a more similar style of Falcon where it's like, you know, super Wizzy inspired, like really like reaction tech chase heavy, you know, aerial in place, but then salt on like, you know, a completely different end of the spectrum, just like running at you a billion aerials. Like it'll yeah. be cool to see kind of how, you know, the mix of match, see if Simmons can, you know, put a dent in, in, in the champ. Salt actually won the last big tournament in this venue at Bemi. Yeah, yeah, Salt definitely, uh, definitely feeling Feeling good in the Joe Mac. Uh, feeling good. Uh, the Captain Falcon loves the Joe Mac Wilson Student Center. Captain Falcon be yeah, putting yeah. some people, work here. People, people don't know about that uh, Falcon history in the Joe Mac for sure. But <laughs> yeah, I got a little hand warmer. I'm curious how the set would go. Uh, what's your as the as the Falcon Falcon on deck? What's your opinion on uh, stages in this matchup? I mean, I really think it comes down to preference. I think you'll see a lot of trends, right? Where, like, Simmons will probably opt for, like... When we played, he did better on smaller stages. But I think that's because we were so similar in playstyle. Like, it's a whole nother layer. Yeah. But against someone like Salt, you know, you might see bigger stages. Oh, my God. Wow. What, how many knees was that? Five? Four? Yeah. Okay. And Salt looking ice cold. Uh, taking take that stop. Wow. Oh, the double <laughs> gentleman. Yeah, she she has yet to put Simmons down, so. Let's go, butt grab. Okay, yes. Wow, great, uh, great to slide off. Ooh, single hit in air. A lot of interesting stuff to jump in. And, oh, you hate Assault to see getting Simmons shook off the rip. Yeah, you hate to see Simmons at the uh, SG there, but, you know, when you. Kind of like what I was mentioning earlier, when you have something like that happen to you at the beginning of the set, it can really either like strap you in and get you really uh, engaged, or can sometimes mess you a little bit. And yeah, we're we're a minute in, and it looks like it's a uh, looks like it, it could be could be a pretty decisive game one for Salt here. Let's see if uh, Simmons can maybe just use this game for information, maybe adapt. Oh, the double pivot. Yeah, it looks like Salt just got Simmons stuck. Oh, nice. Ooh. Okay, he went for there the swag. He went there for the we swag. Go. Let's go, Simmons. Yeah, this matchup is one where, you know, as quickly as you saw Salt take that stock, Simmons could as well. It's just all about being ready for those extensions and being ready to find the knees. These near ones are like blowing my mind. Yeah, that, just having a, having a laugh about some of, some of the interactions. I feel like, uh, Looks like FT is the FT's the counter pick. Wow, and this one just running in with a straight to get getting hugs. Great CC there. The get him attack. Oh wow. Lots of singles. I've seen a lot of single hit in air from Solomon. Yeah. Ooh. Gentlemen. I like that Raptor boost. Simmons barely managed to get that shield up, but it's scary. Also, these gentlemen right on the ledge are so scary, but Salt's been so consistent with them. I don't know how she does it. Yeah, Simmons, Simmons uh, doing all right here. I feel like what I've been seeing is just more Simmons struggling to get their bearings in neutral. Blood. Yeah. Once Simmons gets the hit, Simmons is doing He's been fine. doing some work, but Salt's just like blowing him up with like these little like near one strings and gentlemen's and like, yeah, it's, it's hard. Like, it feels like uh, just more. Oh, kill? Nice. Yeah. Okay, Simmons taking the lead. Simmons taking the lead, yeah. It, it really just feels like uh, the neutral was the big thing. Uh, kind of Salt finding ways to convert scraps into openings a lot better than than Simmons is, but Simmons uh, looks like he has woken up and sort of really, really come alive with this set in game two. Oh! And we got, uh, we got Simmons cooking up right now. Oh my god, what is he cooking? I will say, Simmons does also feel like a very, like... Okay, so... Simmons, Simmons, when, uh, whenever I've seen them play or, or play them, they just they seem like a very unfazed Falcon, you know. Yeah. I feel like, uh, you know, 
with Falcon, you can be a bit of a glass cannon sometimes, and if you can come out the other end and double like, raptor boost, sir. Uh, oh my god. This is like my Falcon brain is like exploding right now. Like yeah, this is I'm, crazy. I'm like trying to, to say something. But they're just and, doing so much crazy they're stuff. They're just doing so much crazy stuff that's just interrupting my my train of thought. My monkey brain is just getting attracted to all the sick talk play right now. Okay, big grab. Oh, up throw might have been the one there, but gets the raptor boost pivot knee. What's going on? Oh, more near one. He's trying to go for that. Yeah, it looks like it's a, a late nair, uh, instant, like, full hop knee to try to cover that buffering jump. Yeah, Salt showing that she has some crazy, crazy tricks to fix up her sleeve, but... Often yeah. not to go back to FD, I'm cu curious about that, I feel like, uh, Simmons did very well there, but... Yep. Through time. Oh, barely missing that tech chase there. Yeah, I do feel like the the tech chases haven't been the, the best, especially when Simmons or Simmons is trying to, to re grab, but still is just finding a way to get to get across the finish line in the stops. He was getting some good ones, uh game one, like the start of game two, I feel like, but you know, he might just be so shook after like that reversal, like the, yeah. the, the comeback last game. But we'll see if he can bring it back together. Definitely, I what feel is like, Salt doing? I feel like playing, just seeing all these extensions is just it's such a, just a treat. Like even even as Simmons here, I think you can sort of see in the way that you know they're 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 emoting between games that like they just know they're playing like one of the best Falcons. Yeah, this is just good melee, and it's, it's like Salt's too. She's she's a player that's like so creative and unique. You know, it's, it's just a treat to just like be able to to yeah. partake in that. Yeah, you hate to you hate to see you hate to see uh, you know these one-sided sets, but I think um, especially in like uh, when you're playing someone much better than you in the ditto, it's just you feel like you can glean a lot more from it than maybe just yeah. getting outplayed by a top player who doesn't play your character. Yeah, for sure. So she's just salt. Like she does so many just unique things. Like I feel like every Falcon right now has a lot to learn from her. That's yeah. my two cents on salt. Especially the kind of Falcon that plays like Simmons and myself, and no hate to that kind, but like, yeah, clearly yeah. this is good too, you know? Yeah, clearly, yeah. Clearly the ability to not only, you know, rely on the more traditional Wizzy style tag chasing is, is great, but like, to have these sorts of wacky extensions and ways to catch people slipping, it's just... So it's the movement tricks, like the way she's been like pivoting around him and like... Yeah, I feel like it's... <laughs> the SD, the SD there. Salt just trying to. Yeah, Simmons. Get Simmons some hits another there. another southeast player, so get, definitely getting some some cheers from the crowds. Oh. Great up here. That was good for Simmons to take back there. That was almost the stock if he didn't escape. Oh wow! What a back air. Crowd cracking me up. The gentleman. Oh my god, these wow. moonwalks. Yeah, Salt is playing with fire, like you're Salt I just feel like has no fear. Wow. No fear. Wow, 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 wow. GG's. That was a fun set. Two awesome a... players right there. Yeah.